Alright, it's on art. Hey guys, Savage Thomas here, and today I'm gonna be teaching you guys due to like demand and a lot of people asking me how to install shaders with motion blur, which really makes no difference, which is what I'm saying, but I don't know, maybe you can tweak the settings if you want. So the first thing you wanna do is go to this website, reshade dot me which I will put in the description then you're gonna scroll down blah 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 and then you find this the, it should be the latest version I don't know it might be a different version for you but it should be the same website unless they change it so you're gonna press download wait a little bit alright then this pops up alright then what you're gonna do is just press it and it should eventually run or you just press run program it says select game you're gonna press this, ignore that little thing, whatever it says. Then wherever your Roblox location is, it should be located there. So I suggest going to your desktop, the easiest way. Then you should see Roblox player, then you right click it, then open file location. So let me do that again. So I was over here, I press desktop, scroll down, right click this and open file location, okay? Now, here's people get confused about this sometimes. This is Roblox Player Launcher. That's different. That's the screen you get when you're loading a Roblox game. This is the actual Roblox application. You're going to click this. Alright, then it says select rendering APA. API, my bad. And, uh, I don't suggest, do suggest doing these if you have a bad PC. But if you're not sure, then click this. But go right ahead and pick one of these. It doesn't matter. And then it says you wish to download a collection of effects. So yes. It doesn't take that long, like five seconds. Okay, then just press OK. And then done. You're pretty much done. That's really it. <laughs> so let me go to a Roblox game. Uh, <clears throat> let me see. Showcase. Because people can get confused about this when they first enter the game. They're like, what do I do? Uh, this, that, that. I'm like, hold up, chill, chill, chill. Alright. Let's see which game I could join. Crystal Caves. Ooh, I ain't been there. Whoa, whoa. What the heck? Okay, let's get out of there. There's an ad. Mmm. I don't know which game. Because there's an ad playing. Let me do it again. Okay, let's just do, let's do this. Okay, this is 2014, it might not look as good as a showcase. Alright, I think I'm going to switch to Roblox then before my stuff starts lagging. Alright, let me switch. Uh, switch. Hold up, it might take some time. Okay, there we go. So you see this little effects things pops up in the corner and then it loads. It's gonna load. It's, it's gonna be laggy for a second. Just just wait. Just wait. Let's go. Let's go. Alright, okay. It should be on, right? Correct? Correct, Amundu. Oh, wait, this is a pretty old showcase. Whoa. Okay, let me turn out this volume. Okay. So now what you're gonna do is press shift plus F2. I don't know, that pops up for me. I just press shift plus F2 again and it should go away. There we go, it went away. So it says, would you like to continue to press the button for the, to continue the tutorial? So you click that. Then it will say, make up a preset. So what you do is press this. Then you can make a name for it. I'll just say video enter okay now you get all of these things and you see motion blur and fake motion blur and a bunch of other stuff okay then what you're gonna do is just click some stuff if you want amber light you click that i'd say get amber light bloom is really nice as well let's see what else is nice they have fxaa which is really nice now i'm pretty sure they do yep it's really nice then i say get motion blur but and everybody wanted it. I was like, okay. Let's just switch it right here. Motion blur. There we go. And then 
There, there you go. It's not that good, but you can edit the settings to the motion blur. And I'm telling you, this is 60 FPS. This is how the motion blur looks like. So, uh, yeah, guys, if you want to edit the settings, just press Shift plus F2. And then there's some other things. You can go down here. You can check your FPS. I don't know. I don't know why mine says it's 70. Show clock. But, uh, yeah, guys. Uh, thanks for the suggestion for a video because I haven't made a video in a long time. And, yeah.